Hey everyone, welcome back to TQ Claws. Today's video is going to be a small kind of version of Patch's cage cleaning process. I know I've said many times that I've always wanted to do a video like this, and so I decided that today would be the day to do it. Now, in case you're wondering, I do clean her Patch's cage every Sunday, so without fail, every Sunday I clean her cage. And I only do it not one time a week. But on Wednesday, I do a mini cleanup where I vacuum this side and um, move some of the bedding around so it can get some fresher on top and stuff. Now, as you can see, I have removed her ramp cover over here. Her bed, her toys, her house, and her water bottle are all over there. Right there, I have a vacuum and my sister here. Uh, I have a video that will be coming up the same day I'm filming this, which is Sunday, of course, um, about... Her. Everything that I use will be listed in the description below. A trash can. And bedding wise is what I'm talking about. I have her first bedding, her second bedding, and her paper. Her newspaper in there. I have a dustpan, gloves, and her wipes are over there for some reason. But let's go. A lot of this might be sped up. Um, I'm not sure yet. So right now I am just going to start by putting on gloves and cleaning out the cage. I will try to show you some parts, but one thing I want to say before we go is one, she's loud, and two, this whole chunk gets removed. I remove it and then shake all the extra stuff out of here. I'm going to lift up the cage and pat it with my hand. I hope that you will be able to. And this is that. And I'll come back to you in a minute. So now I'm just going to take the vacuum and vacuum up some of this dust before I wipe it down. After I vacuumed it, this as it looks like still some dust and stuff, but now I'm going to wipe it down with my wipes. to replace this back in here and I'm going to do a speed through of the bedding.
know, this is how Patches was chilling during the cage clean process. So this part is done, clean, but now I just have to vacuum up dust, put her rug back in, and put her water and her food back in and all that. But thanks so much for watching. If you want more videos like this kind of style, please let me know. And subscribe to this channel for more awesome and more helpful guinea pig videos. I'm pretty sure that the next video will be a grooming video. And yeah, there you go.